acceptance. Uh, and, I, and you know, with us, we, we just work hard. You know, his diet on point, his uncle, his uncle Bone, great chef. Uh, you know, he, he's, he works hard. Um, he takes care of his body. And there's, there's nothing else you can really, really say about anything um, besides hard work, man. And I was bringing it up more, more because of Canelo, you know, he got caught with the best on in his systems. Um, how would we know if, if he was indeed taking that substance intentionally come fight time? And how would we be able to distinguish if he was doing that purpose or he wasn't like, I can't, I can't really tell. Um, it's, it's usually, if you're, if, you, if you're a specialty in this game, um, you really know uh, what, what goes on and what people are taking and what people are not taking. But, you know, um, I, I just say to myself, you know, I thank God that he's still able to fight Triple G coming up. Uh, that's not my camp to reveal of what was going on or anything else like that. But, like, just a prime example, you can just tell when someone's actually taking something yeah. uh, by their body built. But, you know, at the end of the day, I give my hats off to his camp. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing that fight in September. And, you know, the best man win, you know? But yeah. my main focus right now is uh, with Darius Miller, man. And we're ready to come and we're ready to rock. Man. All right, is this the performance that's going to separate him, man? And people are going to be like, okay, this is, this is the guy. Oh, ready. yeah. Oh, yeah. This is going to separate him uh, very much so. Uh, so much that it's going to put us in a better position. But we got to keep on winning and keep on working, man. Because mm -hmm. that's what the game is all about. Yeah. You know, just because it's a one big fight don't mean that you slack off the, the next couple months because you just want a big fight. No, we got to keep on working, man. Yeah. That's, that's what we do. When fighters hit that kind of that wall where they're like a little bit tired or they're exhausted or you can see that they're starting to physically work down, how do you go about that as, as a strength and conditioning coach? Uh, as, a, as a strength and conditioning coach, you know, uh, rest is very important. You know that. Uh, rest. Uh, making sure that they're they're getting the proper vitamins, the proper minerals, the proper foods in their bodies, uh, and then there's there's different levels to that, like to uh, to critique that, mm -hmm. um, and you know we we critique we critique everything that we need to do uh, for our camp. So you know I think that we're comes August 3rd, man, we're going to be ready, man. Yeah. And I, I think a lot of a lot of people are waiting for this fight and see what he could do. Yeah. All right, man, I appreciate the time.